Six Just Stop oil campaigners who breached a High Court injunction banning them from protesting outside the Kingsbury oil terminal in Warwickshire have been fined a total of £3,000. 21 people from the group were arrested at the depot near Tamworth last month, with several returning to the site while they were on bail. Some remain in custody tonight after a fire in the court building delayed proceedings. Andy Bevan reports. Just Stop oil protesters are used to hanging around for long periods, but a two-hour wait outside court today to discover their fate hadn't been on their agenda. A small fire in the ventilation system at Birmingham Magistrates Court forced an evacuation of the building after just three of the activists, Simon Redding, Stephanie Pride and Catherine Rennie Nash, had each been fined £400 for breaching a High Court injunction banning disruptive protests outside the Kingsbury Oil Terminal in Warwickshire. A fourth, Gwen Harrison, was fined £900 for going to the site on several occasions. So what kind of mad system is it where those people who are desperately, desperately doing everything they can, risking everything, trying to secure a livable future, are the ones that are being sentenced to prison or given massive fines? It's, it, the system doesn't work, it's broken. Once the fire service had dealt with the incident and given the all clear, proceedings resumed with 70-year-old Molly Berry and 74-year-old Vivian Shah from Leicester, each fined £450. A spokesman for Just Stop Oil said there was a parallel between today's interrupted court proceedings and their own warnings about the increases in UK oil production. When we were told that there was a fire in the, in the building, um, we all came out. None of us said uh, or were told to stay there for until 2050 or 2030. Um, we'll just see how it turns out. No, there's an emergency and we responded to the emergency and that is what this is all about. Is we have a, a climate and ecological emergency and we're in the sixth mass extinction and we have to re respond now. More protesters from Kingsbury will appear in court tomorrow and on Thursday. Several are on remand and have been staging a campaign of non-compliance at Foston Hall Prison in Derbyshire. One of them, Michelle Charlesworth, glued her hand to the Perspex dock when she appeared here last week and had to be released by police and court officials. Andy Bevan, ITV News.